I'm Erica Natividad at the Metropolitan Center in Scarborough, the headquarters of Anthony Fury, the former Toronto Sun columnist turned mayoral candidate. And you can see plenty of people have come out tonight to support Fury, who really wasn't a prominent candidate to begin with in this race. He wasn't spoken about much. He wasn't in the debates, but he gained momentum as this race went on, really uh, showing up in the polls as one of the front runners within the past month or so. Fury positioning himself as really the right wing candidate and promising to clean up Toronto streets. He painted Toronto as sort of a city in decline and he wanted to fix that by uh, clearing encampments, by getting rid of safe injection sites and replacing them with treatment centers, by hiring more police officers to patrol things like parks and the TTC. And it seemed to resonate with voters. He landed pretty high, uh, not winning the mayoralty, of course, but uh, getting as farther than probably a lot of people thought he would. We spoke to him earlier and here's what he had to say never let them tell you that you can't stand up for what you believe in and this has been a truly amazing experience for me but when i say we oh boy was it a we so many supporters i couldn't have done it without all of you this is something that we did together now, this is Fury's first foray into politics. I did ask him whether he plans on running for office again, and he said he's not ruling that out, and certainly tonight has shown that he has some support among Torontonians. In Scarborough, Erica Natividad, City News.